that's um, enough about chopped South, South Africa. Yes. I want to get your opinion on some things. Yes. What ingredient does every cook, every single person who cooks, need in their kitchen? Salt. <laughs> <laughs> Olive oil, garlic. <laughs> Don't try and push me now and let me give you one ingredient. <laughs> that's mean. I know. <laughs> But if you, God forbid, said you could ha only have one seasoning in your mm -hmm. kitchen, it would have to be salt for me because that just brings everything together in a dish. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. salt, good. What food trends are you into right now? You know what, I'm into everything that is fresh and local and seasonal. Mm. Let's face it, it tastes better. Um, you can have as much of it as you like because there's an abundance of yes. it. And it's cheaper. You are and making me hungry. I'm making you hungry. This, yeah. And you know what? It's something to look forward to, you know, um, at the moment. Yeah, soon we're going to be having all these beautiful winter veggies. Can't wait. What's your favorite thing to make in winter? In winter, um, I'm a big kind of soups. Soups. I, oh, I'm a sexy soup maker. Let me tell you, I get all souped up in my house. <laughs> my, my family love my soups. And um, I never serve them as a meal. It's always a starter. Mm. And uh, the one thing you will always find is fresh chicken stock in my freezer. Mm. Mm. Delicious. And I love Asian soups. So I will take that out and it's just so clean and delicious. And I'll fling in some ginger and garlic and mm. some star anise and then add all those little crunchy bits at the end. So I would say soup is my favorite thing um, to make in winter. Yeah, all can I come over for dinner? Anytime, darling. <laughs> Now, what, in your opinion, is the best restaurant in SA? Or let's just say favorite. My favorite? You know, I'm not going to actually give you a name, okay. but I can give you a style. Okay. I love Asian, and I like Chinese. Actually, you know what? There's a little Chinese. I love steak. I mean, I love Nelson's Eye. I think he just does the most amazing steaks, mm -hmm. and that Stephen has been around forever, and his quality hasn't changed. It's very retro in there. You know, yeah. you know exactly what you're going to get, and that's why it's good because you know that the meat is going to be outstanding, mm -hmm. you know. And there's carne, and there's just so many wonderful places. But there's a little Chinese place in um, Rondebosch. Okay. Um, it used to be called the Yellow River many years ago. It's now called Chuck Yang's. Wait for this speciality dish. <laughs> it's weird. What a name. Chuck Yang's speciality dish. And Chuck and Tina, um, I've known for many, many years. Mm -hmm. We used to go all the way across to uh, Monte Vista. I live in town um, wow. to, to have his Chinese, he's Taiwanese. Mm -hmm. And if you're brave, you'll eat off the menu on the wall. I mean, you can get anything from snouts to ears to really? but real food, beautiful food um, on the menu. Um, his general chicken, I think, is his number one top seller. Oh, wow. It's beautiful and sticky and crisp and succulent and yummy, yummy, yummy. So if I've got a night off, mm -hmm. which is invariably is like once in a very blue moon, I go straight to Chuck. For yeah. my Chinese fix. Yum. <laughs> you said you like Asian inspired dishes. I love dishes. Asians and I love going to Katima's as well. I mean, mm. Katima, you can just get anything across the board and it's consistently good. Have you tried their Sunday buffet? No. Oh, hello, sister. Oh my gosh, You're losing we need to out. chat afterwards. We have to talk. <laughs> <laughs> no, their Sunday buffet is the bomb. Really? Everything from dim sums to crispy roast duck mm. and broths and roasts and She's got everything. It's oh, amazing. Yeah. <laughs> What's your favorite dessert? I don't like dessert. No! <laughs> no! <laughs> I'd rather have a soup. <laughs> no, <but if, laughs> uh, I look, you know what? I appreciate a good dessert, mm -hmm. but I don't dream and salivate about them. And um, the thought of dessert doesn't make me tremble. But I would imagine that... Oh, I can't relate to you right cheesecake, now. Cheesecake. I like cheesecake a good cheesecake, good. a good baked dense, like when you bite into it, you leave your teeth it's, marks behind. Oh, that sounds Baked good. Baked and beautiful. I love that. And um, I don't know. Um, a really good tart tartan where it's all buttery and it's got a little bit of lemon juice in it so it's not too sweet. You know, the pastry's got to be nice and crisp. That I like. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, last one. <laughs> <laughs> What's the best wine for winter? It's got to be red. <laughs> yeah, just red. Doesn't it's matter. Be red. I like Shiraz, you know, because it's nice and spicy. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, it's got to be red, though. With those beautiful winter mm. dishes, the nice spicy really red nice, wine. Really nice, yeah.